Doctors are calling this a really good start. More than 100,000 North Carolina children between 5 and 11 have gotten their first dose of the COVID vaccine. CBS 17 digital reporter Jody McCrary is digging deeper into when all those shots should lead to a drop in cases. This is the week when kids who were first to get their COVID vaccine can now start getting their second doses. But Duke doctor Michael Smith says figuring out when they'll translate into fewer cases is complicated. It's not surprising to me that as COVID kind of continues or as COVID kind of creeps back, that children, um, just because they haven't had as much opportunity to be vaccinated. Numbers from the American Academy of Pediatrics show cases in kids are climbing once again. During the last two weeks, up 32% across the country. Here in our state, a smaller rise of about 15%. It's really a snapshot of the community. It's kids aren't vaccinated, plus some of the adults aren't vaccinated. That's really the recipe for, for continuing spread of COVID. We know cases won't fall until enough people in an area are vaccinated, but that can take weeks, and the kids are not there yet. So what, what I think you'll, you'll see is um, areas where there's good vaccination, those rates in kids are going to start to go down, or at least plateau as compared to the rest of the country. But with kids still making up about a quarter of new cases every week, the vaccine push is coming at the right time. I think it highlights the importance of, of getting children vaccinated. Among kids between 5 and 11, almost one in eight have already gotten their first shot. We're right now in the first, you know, in the first couple of weeks, we're still trying to accommodate all the people who really want their kids vaccinated. There's one big way to predict if a kid will get the vaccine, and I tell you what it is in my story online. For CBS 17 News, I'm Jody McCrary.